Hello everybody. So welcome back to another episode of the Lori Huntress. Remember I'm Karen, not your average Karen. So today we got a little bit of snow, more of ice mixture, but still works great for showing you guys the Summit Collection. Now don't forget to like and subscribe if you want more videos like this of the gear that I use and what I like about it. First off, I wanted to talk to you guys about the Summit Jacket. Now, I absolutely love this jacket. It has the suction right here for when you put on the gloves, which I'll show you guys in a few minutes. It's super warm. It keeps everything straight to you. It zips up wonderfully. So it also has a pocket right here for like if you want to put one of your calls or your phone, maybe your keys. There's also a little tiny pocket right here which I put a mouth call in when it comes time for that. There's also two big pockets and another little small one right here. They also have the bungee cords to section it closer to you if you want a tighter fit around the hips. Now this right here is also the pit zips. So, this works wonderfully when you're doing lots of hiking, but it's still weather like this, but you need to cool off a little bit. It's just enough of a ventilation to really make it work. And still, if it's even a little bit too much, you can always just unzip your jacket more as much as you need to get more flow through there. But I love this jacket so much and it works out wonderfully during all my hunts that I've done it with. And the hood comes up wonderfully. Now, like I just said about the summit jacket, how they have this right here. This right here makes it so much easier when you need to get your gloves on. Because all you then have to do is leave it up. Kind of hold on to it with like two of your fingers while you get the other few fingers up and in. And that, and then you let go when you're about right here. I also have my Fitbit watch on, which I would not wear when you're hunting because it just gets in the way and it fits wonderfully. I love this glove so much. They also have little toggles so you don't lose them. It has grippies and it's easy with your phone. It's super warm and I love these things. Alrighty guys, so when it comes to these Summit Snow Bibs, I've loved them so far. I have not been able to take them out hunting yet though. That's the only thing that I have not done with these yet. We had a nasty snowstorm a couple weeks ago when I had these and they were wonderful. It was too bad to, of weather to actually film me in them. I wish I could have, but it would have destroyed my camera, so I don't really want to do that. But these things work wonderfully. They held up for the yard work that we had to do to get the trucks out, all that stuff. Now, there's two front pockets right in the chest area. There's one outside that's pretty large, and then there's one inside, too. Nice little extra spot to put your hands if you're cold. Next up would be the hand pockets and the normal spot. There is not going to be any butt pockets because there is a butt flap. Yes, a butt flap. I'm excited too. When I heard that they had butt flaps, I was like ecstatic because it was like, holy shit, I don't have to take off the bib and freeze my ass off. Yes. But, so as you can tell, the butt flap comes down pretty far, which is wonderful, easy to hold on to underneath. I have not used them yet, but we're not gonna talk about that. Also, there is extensions for the boot section in case you're wearing extra pants and you're doing, say, muck boots. That way, everything can still go over your boot to keep the water out. There's also a water-resistant bottom so it doesn't soak the bottom of your feet, which is awesome. So, I really do recommend these pants. There's also another itty-bitty little zipper right here. It's not really itty-bitty. There's also a little pocket right here that zips up and right here. Anyways, I love the snow bib, so I definitely highly recommend this guy so far. Alrighty, next item of business. <music> the 
currently this is not on the Summit collection right at this moment, but it most likely will be again this year or you'll find it on the Girls With Guns website anyways. But this is one of their first ones of their ponytail beanie. And it's super warm. I usually do this when I'm sleeping because I'm not a fan of having a high or like a low ponytail. I'm, I just don't like it personally. So that's when I use the headband one, uh, which is coming out this season again. Stay tuned for that one. I'll show you guys a picture right here. But this one is usually in the Summit collection. Now I'll sleep in this one and it stays on my head perfectly. But it's super cute, super warm, and it's not too tight on my head. It covers my ears and it's super warm. Yay. Alrighty guys, so that is it for today's video. It's starting to snow again a little bit. I gotta get going back inside and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want more videos just like this one of me critiquing my gear that I have, let me know and I will start doing more of those. Thanks guys, have a great day, bye.